Today we're going to be talking about the Fortnite Season 9 trailer and actually showing a Fortnite Season 9 trailer which is absolutely crazy so make sure you watch right to the end of the trailer for the information that you don't want to miss out on but let's play it right now. the same. Brace for impact. Now guys, I've got so much to say about this Fortnite Season 9 trailer. It is absolutely crazy. Just before I talk about that in more detail, thank you to the sponsor of today's video, Dragon City. Now Dragon City is a super cool game. It's free to play on iOS and Android, and I've been playing it for a few weeks, and it is crazy, so make sure you download it in the description. It's so fun. In Dragon City, you can collect hundreds of cool different dragons, just like this cactus dragon you can see right here, which is personally one of my favorites. So dragons actually generate gold that can help you buy food to make your dragons even stronger which honestly is such a cool feature about this game if you breed different species of your dragons you get new ones like this one i just got here this is an epic dragon and i didn't even have this before breeding you can even send your dragons on quests and missions to unlock new buildings which is also really sick about this game there are different pvp modes where you can take your strongest dragon and fight in leagues or in the arena which is so sick if you want to take this game seriously you can also fight against your friends attack them or take revenge if they attack you first which personally I did to my friend the other day and he is very mad right now. Dragon City also has Facebook Connect where you can connect your game with your Facebook account which is really cool. There are new events every week like this maze for example where you can unlock new dragons, collect food, gold and orbs. And also something that has recently been added to Dragon City is the new auto battle mode where you can automate the battle and save time. With all that being said, make sure you download Dragon City today from the link in the description. Now, obviously, that Season 9 trailer wasn't the legit Season 9 trailer that was going to get released, but it was made to be as close as possible to what the Season 9 trailer is going to be like. So, it's going to be something like that. But moving on to the next point, we have the Secret Underground Bunkers. Now, this links onto the trailer massively, so make sure you keep watching. Do not go anywhere. And if you don't know, these got added in, in the new update. And from what we know so far, there's one in Retail Row and also one in Pleasant Park. And the really hard to actually find guys in pleasant park to find it you either have to go to the gap under the stairs and there's like loads of boxes in the way or there's like fake grass in the front garden underneath a tree which is also really hard to find and for the retail row one it's even harder you literally have to mine out the car in the garage and then underneath the car there's a little hole under into the bunker underground and in this bunker there's literally so much and it links on to to, like all of season 9 events that are going to be occurring so let's get on to that season 9 events now there's four potential future events in fortnite for the end of season 8 season 9 and also maybe some that are going to be linking on to season 10 guys so this is crazy now i'm going to do these in order starting with the loot lake event now this has already been occurring you may have seen people streaming it and there's actually runes going around the map when you shoot them they go further and they keep moving them more you shoot them and these 
So these runes are going to be going around the map, going to the runes that the cube actually planted into the ground, picking them up, picking the charge up, bringing it back to Loot Lake and charging the cube up until it should be returning at the end of this season. Next up, we have the Dragon Egg event. Now, the Dragon Eggs were in Polar Peak, as a lot of you guys know, they're in Polar Peak in the underground bit, but then they got moved by the prisoner to the volcano and they should be cracking soon. Well, they already are cracking, but they should be cracked soon. Now, what happens when these crack is that these dragons should be like obviously cracking out of these eggs going out of the volcano going to the polar peak area the snow area and burning it down because obviously dragons they breathe out fire and that is probably what's going to be happening with this event and the final two events i'm going to put it into one all right because we don't have much information on these so far and first of all is the cracks growing around the map and they may actually split the map into what i think to be three different areas the snow area, the like new area with the pirates and stuff and finally the desert area. I think it's going to be split into them three areas but I think that's linking on to season 10 but what should be linking on to season 9 is the volcano event. Now a lot of people think that the volcano is just going to be erupting the one that's on the map already but outside the front of the house with the underground bunker in retail row there's a satellite pointing towards a mountain that looks like a volcano volcano that is miles away from the Fortnite map. Now, this may be the one that's actually going to be erupting instead of the one that's already on the Fortnite map. And there's more proof around this because apparently this volcano that is out of the way of the Fortnite map is designed off the St. Helens volcano that actually erupted about 20 years ago now. Now, if this is true, then this is some serious proof to this happening. And the next point links onto it even more, so make sure you keep watching. Tilted Towers Cut out. Now, in Tilted Towers in the insurance building, which if you don't know, is the building that keeps getting destroyed and then rebuilt again. Like, this has happened probably over 10 times now, guys. It's been destroyed by the cube, meteors, the list goes on. But right now, it's an insurance building, alright? And in there, there's actually some cutouts, guys. There's a cutout of Tilted Towers on the left, the cube in the middle, and the volcano on the right. And around it in the air, there is three meteors these meteors are going towards Tilted Towers, which are obviously representing that Tilted Towers is going to get bombarded with meteors. And there's also the Season 4 rocket, which seems to be going towards the volcano. Now, this is actually crazy. This obviously shows, like, proof onto what's going to be happening in Season 9, maybe the end of Season 8 as well, maybe even going towards Season 10. But there's a crazy leak in this, guys. Now, I said before that this building is an insurance building, guys. And this may be in this building to show what's going to be happening on the Fortnite map. So the citizens on the map buy insurance from this company to keep the houses safe if it gets destroyed by the meteors, the rocket, the cube, the volcano, whatever it is, guys. Finally, we have the Season 8 trailer leaks. Now, usually there are leaks in the last trailer to show what's going to be happening in the season next. Now, this has happened in pretty much every single season, so there's going to be one in Season 8 trailer pretty much. So, let's play it right now and keep watching to the end because I'm pretty sure you guys will figure out what it is. the pirate skin, the ice king, and the prisoner skin all are battling out to get this chest. Now, this could be showing that these guys are all going to battle out in the actual Fortnite map, all right, because they have three different parts of the map. This Ice King obviously has the snow area, the prisoner has like the desert area and the volcano area, and the pirate skin has all the grass area with the new like pirate ship and stuff like that. So these guys could be battling out in this 